nitasema hata nimechoka unakula unga yangu sana wacha ni gawe ishida sasa si ndio against the backdrop of the majestic mount kilimanjaro nice nalente is carrying out a mentorship session this time under the shade of this tree serves as not just a safe space but reinforcement for the advocacy work nice does hebu niambie ni shida gani mnapitia pregnancy teenage pregnancy She's an anti-FGM activist who at the tender age of 8 defied a cultural practice that has persisted for over 200 years. An orphan at the time, vulnerable and under the care of her uncle. Nice recounts the day she was to undergo the cut. A day that was a huge turning point for her. We had already planned on how we are going to escape together with my sister. So, uh we woke up we were five girls, me, my sister and my three cousins. So, we showered with the water, but we walked outside our uncle's home and we went there. I climbed the tree with her help and then she climbed. So, when we were there, we could see even when the circumcisor was coming and a group of men and all that but it was late at night there was dark we couldn't come down we were worried they might find us and all those things they were spared that night but the family insisted nice and her sister undergo the cut to avoid bringing shame to their lineage and community nice left her uncle's house once again and found refuge in a tree but her sister remained When I was in the tree I was really trying to see how I could calm down support her and you know just to make sure she, you know even her she doesn't undergo the cut and all that she was not lucky and she got circumcised and later on she was married and she was not able to go back to school no, no, FGM, no, no. Her sister's sacrifice inspired Nice to get into anti-FGM advocacy work to ensure no other girl would undergo the same i started talking to women men and you know talking to girls in schools and I'm encouraging them to have the education because it's the only way we can win our uh, you know we can win the fight through her work and the help of amref's alternative rights of passage nice has managed to change minds and save 16000 girls from the cut over the last 7 years. We don't just discuss about FGM. We discuss on all forms of of sexual and reproductive health and rights issues. And uh after we see the communities open, the dialogue can now start. That is when we start bringing FGM as a topic and child marriage and all that. So it took time but uh finally they agreed and they're supporting our work. This got her recognized on Time magazine's list of the world's most influential people this year. <laughs> It's gatherings like this that Nice uses to reach out to the community. But also the beautiful part of the Maasai culture, she says, must be kept alive. If you look if you look at the whole process oh, on circumcision ceremonies, people dance, people wear their traditional clothes, you know, cultural leaders sometimes are there to bless these girls to be women. We want to impress that. We want to maintain that because it's good. And it's what makes us unique as the Maasai people and we are okay with it. You know, no one is complaining about that. And in the whole process what is wrong is the cut. Uh, you know, we want to replace the cut with education.